Go Pro Yanu! Hello everyone! Today I will introduce you a game that was just played in GS Caltex Cup between Shinjinso 9P and Baekhongseok 9P. Shinjinso has been winning 29 games in a row against all professional players in the world. That is amazing. And today he is challenging to continue victories of 30th game. So far, Jo Hunyeon 9P has ever done consecutive winning for 30 games. So let's see whether Shin Jin Seok can beat the record or not. An interesting thing is, Baek Hong Seok 9P, he is ranked 49th in Korea. He is also a very strong player. And in 2021, when Shin Jin Seok was winning 13 games in a row at that time, so everybody was very scared of Shin Jin Seok. Then Baek Hong Seok beat Shin Jin Seok and stopped his winning. So Shin Jin Seo is number one player in the world and also in Korea. Baek Hong Seok is ranked in 49th. But Baek Hong Seok beat Shin Jin Seo. Baek Hong Seok was born in 1986. So he is 14 years older than Shin Jin Seo. So today let's see whether Shin Jin Seo can continuously win or Baek Hong Seok can stop again Shin Jin Seo's consecutive winning. Let's start the game. Time limit is 1 hour and 60 seconds Byoyomi only one time. Kumi is 6.5 point. Baek Hong Seok is black and Shin Jin Seo is white. In this game, Baek Hong Seok invaded 3-3 three, three points. After that, white also invades 3-3 three, three points. And again, last 3-3 three, three, of course. So 3-3 three, three invasion happens in 3 corners. It's very common nowadays. And black pincers like this. In this case, Y can consider Hane and attach, or Y can also just attach here and fly like this. This is more for the side. And Hane, which Shin Jin Seo played in the actual game, this is more for the corner territory. Black has to block and attach. Black captures and Y connected. And black occupy the lower side. This is a blue spot that AI recommends. After Atari and Tiger's mouth, why try to make a good shape? This is Joseki that is played quite often nowadays in professional players' game. You see this variation quite often if you see a professionals' game often. And now black played this one space jump, which is a great place and try to expand black's lower side. Black can consider like this or like this. But Baek Hong Seok chose the thickest move. Baek Hong Seok's nickname is Stone Fist. That means his fist is really strong, his attacking is very scary, and his reading is crazy, very sharp and aggressive. So that is his style. So today's game is going to be pretty fun. Oh, so far they have played six games and Shin Jin Seo won five games and lost one game. But this one game was the most recent game two years ago that Shin Jin Seo lost. Okay, let's continue the extra game. This is sent the exchange and Y just went down. Shin Jin Seo loves the territory. This move means, hey, Baek Hong Seo, if you want to attack me, then come and attack me. I'm going to be fine. Okay. Um, yeah, that is that is true. Because white made a tiger's mouth. Here is quite opened and this is also opened. So it's not easy to attack that group. So Pekong Sok occupied this one. Okay, I don't care. I will keep expanding my area. Okay. Then white exchanged this, then came out towards the center. In this case, of course. Why can consider this side also? But Shin Jin Seo thinks the center, I think, is more important. I want center. Okay. Then black jumped. This is also a great place for the upper side. And white occupied the side. Black tried to exchange this one. After white's exchange, white answered. Oh, now if black just tenuki, white is gonna play somewhere here. And this is gonna be too big for white. So, black has to save this one stone like this. After the Shin Jin Seo invaded over here. From now, 
the highlight of this game is starting. How black should play now? Hmm, let's think about next move. I feel like this area is important and this area is also important. But where black should go first? That is the problem. In the actual game, Pekong Sok played this one first. But AI recommends, in this case, this shoulder hit. So even if white comes out, black do this exchange and then hane. Even if white try to come out, black just answers everything and try to be thick. So AI recommend this for black. But the actual game, black make tiger's mouth and white comes out and peep. Black has to connect. Now Shinji's a jumped. So here, I will give you two options. A here and B here. Peep or coming out. Which one would you like to choose? In this case, the better move is B. Did you get it? AI keep recommending, hey, you should come from here. This direction now is the most important area. So if black plays this, white has to go back. Then after that, take the center. This would be smooth. But the actual game, Baekhong Seok played this move. This move means actually, if you protect your weak point, something like that or something like that, and black is going to come out naturally. But Shin Jin Seo says that, I will never gonna connect over here because you cannot cut me. That is true. So this is extra game. If black come out and cut, white is gonna go through. So these three stones are hurt a lot. So this is an overplay for black. So what Pek Kong Seok chose is this move. This move means please split. This splitting is, is not good move because after this exchange, white cannot attack this black, only white made white weak over here and this one. So this is what black wants, but of course Shin Jin Seo didn't play. White played the blue spot. Guess the blue spot next move. Um, it's an interesting move because now like A, B, C, D, somewhere there or E, White feel like somewhere there is the best move, but it's not easy to accurately play that move. So where is that? Oh, this move is the blue spot. When black play this, push naturally. And now black has to hunt at A or just extend. In this case, black has to prepare first. After that, double hane is a better move. But for Pek Kong Seok, fighting spirit, let's go here and let's fight. I'm not afraid of Shin Jin Seo, you. Then Shin Jin Seo immediately cuts. Then the fighting becomes very complicated. So black extends, white extends, black make a shape, and white come out. So now this black is not alive, this white is weak, this black is weak, this white three stones also not connected, very messy. So let's see what's gonna happen. Now black block and try to leave and also at the same time here is open then later black can cut after white come out white went back and since here is blocked black come out now is very important moment for white white really wants to play a and b how nice we can play twice but we have to choose one place where would you like to play if you are white the better move here is a because this black is not alive so when black leaves like this and then naturally black white make tiger's mouth and continuously attack this center this would be good but shin jin so played over here and saying that hey pek kong so you are not alive you have to run away isn't it then pek kong so says huh i don't think so then he played here wow this move means i don't care i'm not scared of your attacking so show me whatever you can so shin jin so is very angry and he played this move okay now since i played twice over here 
You must live inside. Then do you know what Baek Hong-seop did? He ignored his move and Tanuki again. Wow. This is crazy. Like making Shin Jin Seo even more angry. So what's going on now? Shin Jin Seo is really super angry. How dare you ignore my moves? Twice. Baek Hong Seok say that I don't think you can capture my stones. Then Shin Jin Seo, okay. I do this exchange first and black captures that. This is a vital point. And Shin Jin Seo came to kill this black. What do you think? Do you think why can kill this black or is not easy? It seems like black is very weak, but if you find the vital point and try to make eye shape, it's not super easy to just kill. So let's see. Black after this exchange and attached. This kind of place is vital point to create eye shape. In the case, white has to play over here. This was a vital point to break black's eye shape. But Shin Jin Seo played this move. I think he didn't like black to come below and try to make eye shape. But still, A was better. So the actual game, this attachment, and this one is sente. After that, black extends. Then now, black blocks. After that, angry Shin Jin Seo break the eye and try to kill this black. Wow. So if black died, then black has to resign. Black just blocks like that. So after that, white has a weak point. A here and B here. So white has to answer. In this case, white has to block over here in this case. Then black is going to Hane and white answers. Actually, white cannot capture this old black. But still, white can answer like this. After that, just let black leave and white gets sent there and gain something. After that, white got a big place, then now it's very very close game, like half point game. But Shin Jin played this move, and this was yummy place. This is Sente, after that Black Hane here. The moment Black Hane here is impossible to kill this whole Black's group, because this is Sente, after that Black can just make one eye here. So the actual game, why play this one first, after that Black cut, then answers. White cut, then black is alive. Since this whole group of black is alive, the game is good for black. Even though white captured this whole the corner, but that was not enough. And this move, killing move, actually it was Shin Jin Seo's mistake. Now, for white, white has to go somewhere in the center or try to invade here and make the game complicated. White has to do something there first. But Shin Jin Seo just captures, then after this exchange, Black says, okay, whole thing is mine. If everything is Black's area, Black is winning by a lot of points. And now, since Black comes over here, it's so difficult to invade inside. Wow. So Shin Jin Seo invaded like this now. It's like a do or die move, but it was too late. Baek Hong Seok just answered very thickly, played the vital point like this, and Shin Jin Seo tried to live inside like this, but in the end, it's too small area to create two eyes. So after they uh, played some more moves, and the whole thing died, and Baek Hong Seok beat Shin Jin Seo today. Wow, so everyone was very surprised. So Shin Jin Seo's consecutive winning was stopped by Baek Hong Seok, and Baek Hong Seok went to the best 8 in GS Caltex Cup. Did you enjoy today's review? Baek Hong Seok's sharp reading and living skill on the lower side was great, so in the end, he beat Shin Jin Seo. Alright, that's all for today's game. I hope you enjoyed the review. And I will try to make more uh, review videos if you like. Then I will see you next time. Annyeong! Bye!